Five months, 186 car thefts. That's more than one a day in the city of Las Cruces. But police say there is a key factor in the rise of auto thefts. ABC 7's Kate Berry breaks down how you can prevent them. She reports from Las Cruces with our New Mexico mobile newsroom. It seems simple, but if you don't have these, someone could speed off with your car. I went outside, turned it on, came back inside, not even a split second to just get my bag to leave, and all I hear is my car pull out fast. Riso Marquez said she left the key in the ignition with her car running for just a moment, but when she came out, it was gone. Her advice now? Don't ever go outside to turn on your car. Turn it on with the spare key, lock it, you'll be better off. We can eliminate a large number of these auto thefts if we hold on to that key, keep that key in a safe place. Just look at how quickly it can happen. Make sure you know where the key is. Make sure you do not leave the key inside the vehicle. Yeah, make sure you control that key. Uh, the key is the key. With thefts on the rise. Uh, lately, we've seen an increase of, you know, people requesting security systems, you know. More are buying the tools to protect their cars. According to Marco Sarviso, who said he has been selling to owners of... The older vehicles, especially pickups. They managed to open the garage and drag my car all the way out and take it. I've always been a DMX fan. Alex Lucetto beefed up security after his car was stolen from his home. You really can't do nothing because, like I said, my car was in the garage and it still got stolen out of the garage. And you can't make this up. According to the police department, four more cars were stolen today within city limits. It's not yet known if keys were a factor. Reporting from Las Cruces with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom, Kate Beery, ABC7. On top of keeping your keys on you at all times, make sure you avoid leaving valuables in your car like garage door openers, money, and important documents.